All right, everybody, I want to welcome out to ABC News Radio, Paul Baratero. Paul is the founder of Echo H2 Water, and he has some really interesting things to talk to us about, about molecular hydrogen. Now, I'm just learning about the benefits of hydrogen, but Paul's an expert in the field. Paul, um, you came on today to, to share with us the three major benefits that for anybody about molecular hydrogen. What's number one? Number one is reduction of oxidative stress. And so how does hydrogen help our bodies deal with that? So oxygen, for instance, when we talk about oxidative stress, oxygen is an oxidizer. Hydrogen is a reducer. A good example of, of how oxygen oxidizes is like when a banana changes colors or an apple changes colors when it's sitting right. out in the air for a little while, right? Is that what's happening to our bodies? Is it impacting our yeah. bodies like that? Yeah, in, in, a, in a way, oxidation stimulates the reaction of the body. So, you know, we always have yin and yang, right, in life. We have opposites and there are systems <clears throat> in life, everything, we have opposition because opposition is healthy. So where we have oxidation, then we have reduction. We can utilizing hydrogen, which we have many, many clinical studies showing that it reduces oxidative stress. And really, what we have in the body that produces out of whack oxidative stress are called reactive oxygen species. So we have certain free radicals. Everyone hears about free radicals, and most free radicals have a physiological role. In other words, they help us be healthy. But there are a few reactive oxygen species that damage our cells. They're called cytotoxic because they're toxic to our cells. And one of those, for instance, is a hydroxyl radical, which is the most cell damaging free radical we have in the body. So when we look at what makes up a hydroxyl radical, it's a hydrogen and an oxygen. That's all it is, one hydrogen, one oxygen, but it wreaks havoc in the mitochondria. So when we combine hydrogen with HO, now we have H2O, and we create a water molecule out of the worst free radical that's damaging our cells. That's how hydrogen naturally in the body helps, by converting a cell-damaging free radical into a water molecule within the mitochondria. So it's very simple chemistry, but very far-reaching. It's great to know that, that hydrogen is there and did help our bodies balance better. Um, you said the next right. major like, issue that we face, that hydrogen helps us, is what? Inflammation. So, so it, are, is it, does like everybody out there pretty much dealing with inflammation and maybe they don't even know it? Yes. So we have low levels of inflammation in most people, and some of the telltale signs that people don't usually pay attention to is bad breath in the morning. For instance, breath, having bad breath in the morning has to do with a lot of things, but one of those things is inflammation in the body. Also, the plaque on our teeth, the fact that we have plaque building up in our teeth, it has to do, it, it's a sign of inflammation in the body. So a lot of these little signs of inflammation, people probably have just been living with for so long that they just think it's normal. Yes. But hydrogen can actually help all of these things and, and, and help them be just generally healthier. Right. So, and the way it should have happened, I mean, because people always ask me the question, well, you know, before you made your water machine that dissolves hydrogen in water, before you understood that hydrogen had such an effect, what was going on that we would receive hydrogen naturally. And actually the body was designed, created to develop hydrogen on its own. We can actually produce up to 10 liters a day of hydrogen through the fermentation process in our gut if our gut is working correctly. And that's normally how we would reduce oxidative stress in the body naturally. So that's why it goes back to if the gut is not performing correctly and we don't have the appropriate bacteria strain, then that system doesn't work and we have oxidative increase and inflammation. But so right now, like the average person is not eating a really good whole foods organic diet. They right. have, uh, there's a host of environmental factors that are impacting 
you know, every human that lives today. And so if their body's not producing enough hydrogen, then they, they need to augment that and they need to fix that. Right. And that, that's where echo H2 water comes in. That's right. And when, when people do that, that's when we see people have tremendous benefits within minutes, within 30 minutes. Hydrogen is number one on the periodic table, right? So it can, it's tiny. It can go anywhere in the body that's needed. And so it, it's really an amazing thing. And it's not something that takes 30 days a year. It's fast. Yes. So, I mean, you, we've covered the, the benefits of it reducing oxidative stress and helping inflammation. What would you say is the third like major bullet point benefit? I know there's, a, I mean, there are a lot of benefits listed on right. this website, but what's the next like major one that it can help anybody? Cognitive increase. So we mentioned Parkinson's. Parkinson's is a neurologic disorder. And obviously it's, it's neurologic means brain function. And so we can increase brain function or what we call cognitive increase through hydrogen because when hydrogen gets into the body, it will stimulate gastric ghrelin. Now, not everybody knows what ghrelin is. It's the hunger hormone. So whenever you feel hungry, that's the body. The body then produces what's called ghrelin secretions. So leptin is in the body. And most people, for some reason, know what leptin is, but they don't know what ghrelin is. Well, they work together. Yeah, that's true. There are two master hormones. One of them, ghrelin, tells you you need to eat. The other one, leptin, tells you to stop eating. They function together as a set. Well, many people are not leptin sensitive anymore because they are what's called sugar burners instead of fat burners. And so ghrelin secretions and leptin secretions work together for fat storing, for weight gain, for weight release. They're two master hormones and hydrogen stimulates ghrelin and leptin. The reason we would want that stimulated in the body is when ghrelin is stimulated, it affects the hippocampus, the hypothalamus, the brain stem for increased function, so brain power. You know, and that's why you see people with Parkinson's or Alzheimer's or things like this have almost an immediate reaction within an hour because you're stimulating ghrelin secretions. Now, ghrelin should be being produced in the gut as well. It's, it's called gastric ghrelin. And so hydrogen stimulates the body to produce that ghrelin. And so you are increasing that cognitive function. Now, there's many, many other organs in the body that ghrelin also stimulates, but for today's conversation, we can stick to the brain and sure. increasing. And, and I can assume that back in when we were you know, hunting for food, when you were hungry, it's probably good that you were a little smarter because you're hunting something. And that cognitive increase that naturally would occur if you're hungry would make you a better hunter, a sharper individual. So right now when I get hungry and I choose Oreos, <laughs> I not be as intelligent as our, uh, as, our, as our forefathers. But So you're yeah. saying that I have these tablets here yeah. um, that are from your company. They are effervescent hydrogen tablets from, uh, hydro, from Echo Hydrogen Enriched Water. Yep. You're saying that by taking these, these tablets and putting them in my water, I can receive all of the benefits that you just talked about? Yes, and many more. Yes. So the way the tablets would work is you would grab a 16-ounce bottle, fill it all the way up with water so there's no airspace, drop a tablet in it, put the lid on it, and wait a few minutes until the tablet has dissolved. At that point, you're going to have roughly 1.5 parts per million of hydrogen dissolved in the water. And when you drink that, it's going to increase energy and it's going to do the other things that we talked about. But yeah, that will give you all of those benefits. You know, it's, it's really amazing when we yeah. start learning about hydrogen. I know that there's a lot of information out there and people can, and can learn about all the powerful benefits. But to think that they can get these powerful benefits, um, from you with the, just this simple thing is really a, an amazing, uh, amazing thing. And so I want to thank you for coming out on the radio today. Um, and uh, this will be broadcast on ABC News Radio, KMET 1490 here in Southern California. 
And then it'll also be on YouTube and all over the internet. So I want to thank you for coming out and being a part of the show. Thank you very much.